Good morning guys and welcome to Vlogtober day 13. We're going to story time. Well, wrong wrong way. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Is it cold? Yeah. Got chocolate milk all over you. So lunch was so good. It was definitely busy in there, but it was a nice local spot. We went to Evelyn's in West Annapolis. So we're just walking back to the car. Just taking our time. It should be her NEP time, but it's just so nice outside. Yeah, you did so well, miss. Yeah. <laughs> Good job. Kim is definitely an outdoor girl. Not like her mom. Unless it's like nice out, <laughs> like right now. But she's definitely like her dad, for sure. We're walking. Good job. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, TV. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Hi guys, so Kim's down for a nap. I thought I'd sit down and give you a quick 30 week pregnancy update. I'm so excited because it's it finally feels like fall. It's in the 60s today and hopefully for like the next couple of months um, I can finally wear a sweater comfortably. I'm not gonna lie, all the times you've seen me wear a sweater or a sweatshirt, I've turned the AC way down, which the hubby did not like. But I was just craving fall so much. Um, and then when we were in, I was in Boston obviously last weekend, it was the perfect fall weather. So since then I was just like, okay, I'm done with hot and humid. I was counting down these past four days um, because I knew today it would reach the 60s. So I'm so excited. Oh, if you're wondering, this sweater is from Primark. Do you guys remember that yellow marigold sweater that I bought in Boston when I went to Primark with my sister? I ended up returning that and buying this one instead. I just felt like this one was more me as much as I love the mustard marigold one. Um, this felt more me. Stripes, obviously, neutral, of course. Uh, but my sister said the same thing. So I went ahead and got this one instead and I feel like I'll wear this one more often. And I'll be wearing this pretty much all fall all winter because it's like super baggy and cozy. I love it so much. So anyway, I wanted to let you guys know about that real quick. But anyway, the allergies that I mentioned the other day turned into a full blown cold. Nothing too crazy, I can still breathe and stuff, but I'm definitely congested. Um, I have a lot of pressure in my sinuses. Um, so I'm hoping this is the worst of it. Being sick and pregnant is not ideal. I don't love it. Um, so I'm hoping it goes away soon, so pray for me. But really quick, I have 10 minutes to do this pregnancy update because Cam should be getting up soon. But what to expect app? I'm week 30, day three, and my baby is as big as a butternut squash, which is so fitting because it's fall. Um, it says nuts are chock full of important minerals and healthy fats, plus they're perfect snacks when you're on the go. I do like nuts still. Um, cashews, I like nuts in general, sweet or salt, salty. Uh, baby's waking is baby's waking is seriously picking up the pace. No kidding, because I feel like I'm gaining weight like no other. Um, so I'm the I'm definitely the type where where I really do try to like maintain my weight healthy, you know, for a healthy pregnancy, the first and second trimester. But for some reason, the last ten weeks where all my weight gain happens, so maybe that's why I feel so swollen these days. But just FYI, if you start to notice I'm picking up the weight. I also think to myself, oh my gosh, like, you know, I won't be able to eat like this for a long time, so I better, like, indulge when I can, which it doesn't bother me, but at the same time, it's something that I am, I'm aware of, you know, so, anyway, so that's happening, and yeah, nothing too specific for a pregnancy update, except for the fact I am so tired, I feel so pregnant, um, but I'm trucking through. So times like these, I wish I had really taken advantage of being pregnant with Cam. I'm just lounging and relaxing and sleeping because I'm not doing any of that right now. Um, and I'm paying for it. I feel like it's obviously, you know, it's one of those things you are mom. So you kind of go through the days. But when you add Vlogtober and then you add mom stuff and then you add pregnancy, it's like... I'm exhausted, so. And my poor hubby, I'm like, I don't think I'm that bad. I'm a pretty positive person, so I don't think the hubby is getting like any sort of like sass or attitude. He might 
beg to differ, but <laughs> I mean, you know, I feel like I'm, I'm pretty positive for the most part. I Obviously this pregnancy is a huge blessing and um, I'm just trucking through. So I feel like I don't let pregnancy define me, you know what I mean? So I try to just go on with my day and just knowing I have things to do, but at the end of the day, I am so exhausted. So my poor hubby, I just feel like every day I'm like, I'm sorry, I'm so tired. <laughs> but anyway, um, cravings, I'm eating a lot more. Um, my appetite's definitely growing significantly since the last updates, um, but I'm eating the same things. It's just that I have no preference, like, I don't know. I, I don't, I obviously want to eat healthy, but I'm always reaching for things that aren't so healthy, like cookies and, um, you know, chips, all that stuff. So I do try to eat healthy, but at the same time, there's pizza, I'm going to eat pizza. Um, if there's tacos, I'm going to eat tacos. If there's ice cream, there's, I'm going to eat ice cream because we have a lot of it. So <laughs> I'm going to eat all those things. And obviously you guys know I have insomnia to the max. Um, my sleeping is like, I mean, I sleep, but not comfortably. I definitely wake up pretty easily. And when I do wake up, it's hard for me to go back to sleep. <sighs> so maybe that's why I'm getting so much work done because I'm not sleeping, you know what I mean? So anyway, I'm uncomfortable for sure. Like I can like, I feel like sitting on the floor is so uncomfortable. I need to sit on a chair. I am obviously grunting. What is she doing? Um, I am grunting and groaning whenever I get up. I've noticed that after a night of editing my vlogs and I get up, my whole entire bottom half is like swollen. <laughs> um, I think just from sitting down, I don't even know because like I'm up all day and I finally get to sit down, I'm editing, but I just noticed that I'm just, my feet and my legs are swollen. Um, so yeah, so that's been happening. Obviously down there, it's so funny. I feel like I've, I've had this like edema um, since like the very beginning of my pregnancy and it just has not stopped and it's just like in that area which is so weird. I'm hoping it goes away. If you guys like have the same thing or have experienced the same thing, let me know down below because it's kind of weird and I haven't asked the doctor yet if it like, if it goes away. You know what I mean? I know, I mean obviously when you're swollen during pregnancy, like that eventually goes away. So I'm just assuming the same thing, but I don't know. I don't know what to expect because I feel like some things in this pregnancy I didn't experience with Cam's pregnancy, you know? So I'm trying to think. I'm so tired. <laughs> but yeah, that's pretty much it, honestly. I am just trucking through 30 weeks, less than 10 weeks ago, give or take. I still have to get the nursery done. I still want to organize my closet. Um, and I'm not fully in nesting mode because I feel like I'm still trying to like get my brain to like focus for a moment. So I'm not in nesting mode yet, but I feel I have a feeling I will be soon. So, oh, my bum. You should probably look at that. Okay, real quick. I'm out of breath, so out of breath. Just from talking. Okay, so this is it. Oh my gosh, I feel huge today. I did go to lunch with Cam. And this is what my bump looks like. It's okay. Good times. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> okay, so perfect timing. Cam's about to wake up. I'm gonna go get her. And then um, we're gonna go outside because it's so nice out. And I will see you guys in a little bit. Uh, I have to look again then. I didn't know if you want a cartoon or like. Family. Okay. We are family. We are family. Yeah. The hubby's home. I'm trying to cure my cold. So we got takeout pho. I'm so excited. So I'm going to end the vlog here. As always, uh, give this video a big thumbs up. And if you haven't yet, subscribe. Oh, you good? And I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Bye. <laughs>